Hello students, this is Remote Learning Initiative undertaken by Shet Vidya Mandir English High School CBSC. Myself Pritam De Silva, your SST teacher, and today we are going to deal with Chapter Twelve, The Age of Machines. Part Two, Industrial Revolution. Students, revolution means change in system. The change in manufacturing system from handmade goods to machine-made goods was called industrial revolution. The industrial revolution began in England because the factors needed for the establishment of an industry were found in Britain. Iron ore and coal was available in plenty. Cheap labor was available. Britain had colonies all over the world from where raw material was brought at cheaper rate. The favorable climatic conditions also helped in the development of industries. Energy for machines. Students, the substances which provide energy to the machines to work are called sources of energy coal mineral oil natural gas and electricity are the conventional or non renewable sources of energy coal earlier machines were run with steam to produce steam steam engines were filled with coal coal was the first fuel used for running the machines but it has the following limitations it is a non renewable resource of energy it pollutes the atmosphere and leaves a large quantity of residue it is not available everywhere students coal takes millions of years to form there is a limited stock of coal on the earth and it is feared that it would last for only about 250 years mineral oil or crude oil students the second most important source of energy is petroleum or crude oil it is drilled and refined petroleum is exhaustible like coal the main products of crude oil are petrol diesel kerosene gasoline most of the modern vehicles use either petrol diesel or cng compressed natural gas and at home we use lpg or liquefied petroleum gas students rudolf diesel invented the diesel engine it is cheaper than petrol heavy vehicles use diesel as a fuel